Well, in the chilling new series, Let the Right One In, a father does all he can to keep his vampire daughter alive. Those around them get sucked into the nightmare, including their na uh, neighbor, Naomi Cole, played by Tony winner Anika Noni Rose, as she raises her son. Take a look. If the world were good, you could, you could wear whatever you want, be exactly who you are. And if I could do a magic trick, it'd be to make the world more like you. Make it worthy of you. The world's. I just want you safe. Oh, and Anika is with us now. Welcome. Thank to you. see you. Thank you so much. Uh, so I got sucked into this show, um, <laughs> and I love it already. But so this, this was a, it was a book, and then it was a Swedish movie. So yes. set it up for us. Well, uh, it's about our version, which is an adaptation of the original film, is about a baby vampire, a little girl, um, played by Madison Taylor Baez, um, whose dad played by Demi Bashir, Bashir, has brought her to New York City. She lives next, they live next door to me. They befriend my son, played by Ian Foreman III, who you just saw, who's a cutie pie. He is a cutie pie. Um, and unfortunately for them, I'm a homicide detective. Right, and so, you're a little skeptical. <laughs> like, yes. not in my neighbor's apartment. Yes, and that child has to be fed, so you know people are, people are going down. Yeah. But it's really about how far you would go for the people you love. What right. would you do for the people you love to protect them and to, pe to, to uh, keep them going? And about the monsters in the world, not always the ones that we can see, but the ones yeah. that we don't see and what turns people into monsters, literally and physically. And yeah, uh, I mean, it's interesting because you see these characters and you think, oh, they're all doing bad things, but are all of them really bad? Because you say it's like, it's, it's kind of discussed as how far you would go to keep the, your loved ones safe. So do you see, these characters as bad or just complicated? I think one thing that we touch on also is addiction and how addiction can turn someone into a monster. And yeah. that's a major tenet in, in yeah. the, the piece as well. Make them be somebody they don't want to be. And I think that bad and good is something that changes depending on the lens in which you're looking yeah. and the angle that you're looking at. So we explore a lot of that on the show yeah. and it's, uh, it's an interesting journey. Yeah, I, I think I said to you before we started this that it's a vi vampire show mm -hmm. on the surface, mm -hmm. but it's about a lot more, like you just just discussed. But um, it's just in time for Halloween too. It is. <laughs> but you know, were, was this always a genre that you were that you were interested in? Because it can be violent sometimes too. Did you do you like watching things like this? I love vampire lore. Yeah. So I have read vampire books since I was a child. Oh, I've yeah. always wanted to be somehow a part of some movie um, where biting is happening. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, you, that, so you can check that right off yeah, the list. Yeah, I've got it. I'm there now. But yeah, I've always loved this genre. Yes, it can be bloody and wild. And I'm not somebody who likes a lot of gore. Yeah. But I like the adventure of the thing, the history of vampires. They were very sexy. Yeah. Our vampires are not sexy. No. They're a little rough. They're a little but, rough. <laughs> they are. But it is it is an interesting journey, and it's a different take on on something we've heard about, known about for a millennium. Yeah, it really is, and it's enjoyable to watch. Um, we got to talk about one more thing, though. If, you know, fans still love you from Princess and the Frog. Now I understand there's going to be a ride, Tiana's Ride Yay! Bayou Adventure at Disneyland and Disney World. Like when you found that out, what even goes through your head? Because that is. That's something not a lot of people get to say they, they got. It is so awesome and fantastic, and I'm so excited about it. I cannot wait to jump on. I'm <laughs> yeah, a ride I girl. I am too. I love rides. <laughs> so is it like a roller coaster? It'll be a roller coaster. It's Fun. taking over where Splash Mountain was, and it's it's going to have a whole story beforehand and some really interesting things that I cannot talk about and I got in trouble the last time I got oh, excited no. and said too much so I'm not <laughs> doing that today but it's uh, it's exciting and it's been it's loved and there was a lot of research that went into yeah. it and it should be fun well I cannot wait to go down and ride it for myself thank you thank you so much and I can't wait to continue watching this show you can catch let the right one in when it hits showtime this Friday October 7th Anika thank you so much always lovely to see you thank you too